We're outside the XLR boost, and Tim, you were saying that this is you saw this the most of a. XLRs. I mean, I personally, I for me as a fifth wheel toy hauler, this is probably the most popular floor plan I sell. The okay. 37 TSX 13. Uh, you know, a lot of people love just the design that they put into this, just because of the free flow uh, in the coach itself, and uh -huh. just all the amenities that it comes with, and just the storage. They maximize the complete amount of storage that they possibly can in this. On a toy hauler, that's important because you lose a lot of living space. Right. So yeah. when you think about, you know, do I really want to do that? You know, they've already thought about, look, let's take care of them in the other ways. I know they're looking for some storage some other uh -huh. way. They do it. And when we get in here, you'll see why I say nice. that. Yeah. I don't yeah. know if I've been, been in an XLR boost yet. Oh, they're cool. So a uh, little bit about this. They recently just contracted with Yamaha as their uh, provider for their onboard generators. Yeah, they did talk so, about that when we went and visited their plant. Oh, did they? Yeah. Okay, cool. So that's a new feature this year that's people love, really. These Yamaha generators are pretty awesome. I don't know if you can get a shot of it. A lot of people's wanting to see what they look like when I talk to them on uh -huh. the phone. This is what it looks like, guys. So this is the, the new Yamaha uh, generator that they're putting in these XLRs. Uh, people are very pleased with them. I so other that. than the name, Mm -hmm. you know, Yamaha's great name. What's what's the what's oh, the I mean, good thing about the, it? Just the the proficiency that they run on. Uh, you know, they're they're quiet. People okay. are always concerned of, you know, when they're in there and they're running their generator. They're like, man, can we can't even talk. It's right. annoying. You know, okay. the these things are way nicer than than what they've been using. Nice. So uh, I'm happy to see them put something of this quality in here, especially when you're selling a toy hauler of this quality mm -hmm. to go ahead and do something like that. I think that's just them forward thinking. Okay, uh, it's. It's a good, it's good thing cool. that they did. Yeah, they were so. excited about it when we when we went out. And oh yeah, them. I'm yeah. sure. So sweet, nice, nice entry. So the cool thing about this is it's got double door entry. Uh huh. With the double awnings, uh, I like that. You know. Yeah. So if you want to start with the toy hauler area, you can do that. You can go right in that area if you don't want people coming into your living space. So let's change it up a little All bit. Right, let's go in the back here. Let's go in the back door. All right. Let's start in a toy hauler area. Yeah. So back here, they provide you with a little half bath. Yeah, uh -huh. you can go ahead. Yeah. So you got a little half bath out here in the toy hauler area. <coughs> Excuse me. Got the nice electric chairs that go in here. Electric queen bed coming up and down. Mount for your TV right here mm -hmm. so that you have it all. That they supplying the chairs for you out here already. Got the patio extension patio. kit. Party on the patio. Yep. Out here. We have that already rock and rolling. Pretty easy. I don't know if you've ever seen these things done. Just, I have. Okay, they're pretty yeah. simple. Yeah, you know, you'd think it'd be some extravagant thing you gotta put the like, oh man. But yeah. it's just yep. nice and easy. Uh, I really like that. But it's cool because if you come out here, you know, at nighttime, it's nice. You got a little light uh -huh. and everything. A little mood lighting. A little moon lighting. Put your little uh, table out here or a blanket and you can sit under the stars. Yeah, it's so awesome. It's kind of cool. Yeah. You got to see the half bath. Uh, I think they do a good job. They led the industry in, in the pool down here, the brackets for the flooring. They're the first ones that come out with that and with the capacity that they can hold. Uh -huh. You know, the cargo area will hold over 2,000 pounds max wow. cap capacity. Uh, I think that's awesome. XLR does a good job with making sure they maximize all that. It's awesome. Uh, yeah, all solar prep, ready to rock and roll for you as well. So, Cool. Let's go in here. Sweet, that's a sweet door. Yeah, okay. this is the three season door. Let's watch. Let's I just think watch that's a step. cool feature. That's I think they were talking to you about custom building. That's something you can add on, take away, uh -huh. whatever you want to do. Um, same with this, if you not particularly want a booth here, you can change that out for seating area okay. if you want. But they have a huge loft up here. Yeah, look at that. It comes clear around the Oh, here. yeah. Sleeping it for inside as well if your kids want to do that. And there is a ladder for it. But it goes all the way around. So you yeah. can see, you can come up here on this side too, Gage. And they have uh, plenty of space up there for a couple of kids, actually. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, very nice. Overhead storage up here if you ever need it. You better be pretty tall, though. <laughs> but, yeah. It's nice fireplace. They have here 
plenty of storage and, and area to put whatever you need, your direct TV box, et cetera, et cetera, that you utilize as far as your, your TV purposes. And man, that's a big pantry. Either big pantry or very cool ladder to get up to the... Even better. Yeah. Yeah, I'm Real sure ladder. that it's been used that way before, yeah. <laughs> you know, with some kids or whatnot. But yeah, when that happens, you just use this. Yeah, get off here. of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know. So, uh, pretty neat. Yeah. Uh, I like what they do with the wood grain on the refrigerators. Uh -huh. Pretty neat. Kind of blends in. It does, man. It really does. But this little area back here, you almost feel like you're in your own little area. Yeah. Back here cooking. Yep. You're out of the way. So, if somebody else is watching TV, you're, you know, you're not cooking and in their way. It, it, it kind of works out perfectly. Yeah. So, hey, honey, what do you want? Oh, you know, hey, catch. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so... Um, There's already a in. lot of space in here with the garage. You know, you got the garage and you still have all this space. It's crazy so how much space you still yeah. have, especially with the sleeping capacity yep. up there. Or even if you just use it for storage or whatever you do, it's right. that's a huge space to do that yeah. with. Um, coming in the bathroom area, man, lots of space for your linen if you need to. Uh, they got that in here, medicine cabinet area, which is nice. Got the nice toilets. But these showers are humongous. You got plenty of space in there. So if you're a big person, you got room to move around in there. It's not, these corner showers are really, really nice and roomy. So you're not in there just tight, close right. fit. Got the nice vanity that opens up into the medicine cabinet area where you would provide whatever you need to. So you do have that capability in this one. And I do like this metal sink opposed to the other type. Just a preference that I have um, with the underneath storage. If you ever need to get to anything under there, you, you're able to do that. And it's not a, really a hassle to, to interchange things if you down the road need to do that yourself. So we'll go through this way and I'll meet you on the other day on the other side. Kind of got your barn theme look uh -huh. over here with the overhead storage for the clothes if you need to do so or whatever you need to put up in there. Got your phone charging ports. Got a place for your CPAP machine if you need something like that with the plug-ins on the outlet wall there. Uh, got nice breeze for the pass-through windows if you want to open them up. Good space for hanging up clothes. If you got some nice clothes, you got somewhere you got to go and dress up. There and here. Yep, they're in there. So you got his and hers areas to do that with. <clears throat> Very nice little area if you got somewhere where you know somebody's in the bathroom, but yet your your wife or spouse or whoever's trying to get ready, she's got a nice little vanity area here if she wants to turn this into that to yeah. get ready while you're getting in ready in the bathroom or whatever it might be. But they've done a great job. Um, the color schemes they've come out with this past year, I think they really have uh, lightened up a lot of things opposed to what they had before and. It's really just catching fire yeah. on the market. It's nice. There's a lot going on in this, a in lot. this toy hauler. Yes, there is. When I think of XLR, though, I think of quality. That's uh -huh. the first thing I think of. That's the first thing that comes to my mind. Brent Stevens and his team that we work with are just fantastic. Yeah. Well, Always cool. easy to get a hold of. Never put us off on the phone. Really? XLR's team is probably my favorite team to give shout-outs to whenever they, we do anything. They were Because awesome. I tell you what, they're fantastic. Yeah.